हे प्रभु आनंद दाता ज्ञान हमको दीजिए ज्ञान हमको दीजिए प्रभु ज्ञान हमको दीजिए शीघ्र सारी दुर्गुणों को दूर हमसे दीजिए हे प्रभु आनंद दाता ज्ञान हमको दीजिए लीजिए हमको शरण में हम सदाचारी बने लीजिए हमको शरण में हम सदाचारी बने ब्रह्मचारी धर्म रक्षक वीर प्र वीर व्रतधारी बने हे प्रभु आनंद दाता ज्ञान हमको दीजिए प्रेम से हम गुरुजनों की नित्य ही सेवा करें सत्य बोले झूठ त्यागे मेल आपस में करे हे प्रभु आनंद दाता ज्ञान हमको दीजिए ज्ञान हमको दीजिए वेल नमस्ते एंड गुड मॉर्निंग इट्स अ ब्यूटिफुल मॉर्निंग एज वी वॉक थ्रू दिस फॉरेस्ट इन जमेका क्वींस न्यूयॉर्क Sometimes we have to move away from the concrete jungle and we go to a place of solitude where the birds are accompanying the trees the fresh air moving away from this covid and um we enjoy the fresh air oh so beautiful it's a beautiful here in morning and um Well, I want to welcome you to this Monday of ours, the Monday of nature, where all the elements are, are murtis, and this being Sunday morning here in Jamaica, New York, um, we are accustomed to go to the temples, but most of us we can't go to the temples because, of course, we have to observe safety rules so that we don't. contract this um, covid but let us play adorations to surya narayan oh bhur bhava swaha tat savitur varenyam bhargo devasya dhimahi dio yo nah prachodayat ओम भुर्भुवस्व तत्सुर्वरेण्यम भार्गो देवस्यमह धो यो न प्रचोदय ओं भुर्भुवस्व तत्सुर्वरेण्यम भार्गो देवस्यमह Dio yo na prachodayat. Adorations to Surya Narayan, the source of life, because from that fireball, that is a hundred and eight times the size of Mother Earth, ninety-three million miles away, is sending its rays to us that keeps us alive. Without the sun, you know we can't. survive and from around the sun the nagrahas rotate and around the or uh, the earth the moon rotates so we have all the planets in our disposition this morning i want to talk a little about uh, the four yugas 4320 years that lord brahma has created and vishnu bhagwan is sustaining and um over the four yugas dwapa um satya treta dwapar and kaliyuga we are in the kaliyuga now and we are ending and 
when this is finished, then the whole cycle will continue again. But we wouldn't be around for that, so we shouldn't be worried. Anyway, I, um, I welcome you to this Mandir and being in a prayerful position. You know, they have this song that goes like this. Nadiya na piya kabiya punajal Vriksha na kai kabiya punefal Apne tanaka manaka dhanaka Dujo ko de do dhyan hai Vo sachai na saanare Is dharati ka bhagavan hai Join with me. Nadiya na piya kabiya punajal Vrikshan kai kabhi apne fal Apne tan ka man ka dhan ka Dujo ko de ro dhyan hai Wo sacha in saan re Is dharati ka bhagavan hai You know, the bhajan is saying That 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 persons who learn from nature Here the trees will be bearing and the birds are coming and fruit trees we go, human beings go and pick the fruits and eat it. And the fruit the trees is giving and asking for nothing in return. It's so self-sufficient. And um, the river also, it's flowing, coming from the mountains like the Himalayas, coming from the glaciers. And mythologically, the Ganga came from the... Um, Ganges came from Mother Ganga. So, so water, river is so essential. So we should be like the river. And that river comes and nourishes all of us, give us the water to drink, take farm the lands. And from evaporation of that water, it goes and it creates rain, the cycle of the food. So how should we not be like that river? And if we do, the Virgin is say, then we are verily gods and goddesses on earth. And, and it's how beautiful it is. Agar sa jis ka ang jale aur dunya se meet swaas de Deepak se us ka jeevan hai jo dujo ko apna prakash de Dujo ko apna prakash de Dharma hi jis ka bhagavat gita Dharma hi jis ka bhagavat gita Seva hi veda puran hai Wo sacha insan re Is dharati ka bhagavan hai Nadiya na piya khabi apna jal Vrikshan na khai khabi apne fal and this verse is saying, we have to be like that dia that gives the light. But first, we have to become that light. We have to do our meditation and we have to do seva. When we do the seva, we'll be cleansing our mind. And this cleansing of mind, when we shed the worldly affairs, the worldly attention and importance, and then that transitions into divine relationship. And how do we do this? We have to go to our scriptures. The scriptures are the ones going to guide us. The Gita, the Vedas. So this is so important that on Sunday morning, we listen to this kind of divine talk. We must imbibe, imbibe on it. It is not just for listening and then we forget about it. Because we've been doing that for all our lives. That's why we're not progressing. And and the next verse says that um, oh, um, all right, let's go on to the, um, my talk this morning. Anyway, I promise I'll do the, the incarnations of Vishnu Bhagavan. And it goes like this, a song that describes it. Pralaya payodi jaledrita vanasi vedam vihita vahitra charit Ah, what is the first one? The fish. Meena Sharira, the body of a fish. And this next one, 
क्षत्रिय विपुल तव तिष्टति पृष्टि धरणी धरन किन चक्र गोरिष्टि केशवधृत कुरम शरीर जय जगदीश हरे जय जगदीश हरे द टर्टल एंड फ्रॉम दैट बैक ऑफ द टर्टल दैट विष्णु भगवान टुक द फॉर्म ऑफ अ टर्टल एंड देन ही पुट ऑन हिज बैक द मॉन्ग माउंटेन एंड द आसरस एंड द एंड द देवस वर चर्निंग द माउंटेन इन द ओशन with the snake vaisuki this is mythological of course this is you know you they, but mythology is so powerful in our tradition and what happened they churn and they churn and what came out of that oh you know it that came out of it the nectar that were taken by the devas and they flew off with it and they dropped it in the four places of pilgrimage kumbha mela haridwar nashik ujjain and har and 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 uh, yeah allahabad so when these are the bo- major places of pilgrimage for us it's for, and it's coming from there and also from that churning of the ocean mother lakshmi came and this is our history so from the turtle incarnation vishnu bhagwan and then vasati dashan shikare dharani tav lagana शशनी कलंकल वनिमग्न केशवरीत सुखकर रूप जय जगदीश हरे जय जगदीश हरे ओम एंड दिस वन इज द बोर्ड पिग हु सेव मदर अर्थ वन इज सिंकिंग इन द ओशंस बट अगेन दिस इज ऑल मेथोलॉजिकल एंड वी हैव वी बिलीव इन इट देयर इज नो रीजन नॉट टू बिलीव दैट दिस इज फैक्चुअल आल्सो and then i'll sing just the chorus because of time limitation keshavadrit ba avam keshavadrit narahari roop jay jagadish hare jay jagadish hare narahari roop this is hiranya kashipu when vishnu took to bhagwan took the form of the man and the lion because there was a um nursing had this power that he cannot be killed in the day or the night he cannot be killed inside or outside he cannot be killed by a weapon he cannot be killed by a um so what happened vishnu bhagwan at the at the time of dusk when the when it was getting dark from sunlight to darkness he took him inside the doorway of a house and he because he took the form of narahari lion form lion and human form and he used his claws to kill hiranyakashipu and also from that we have the story of prahalad next one keshavadrita bamana roopa jay jagadish hare jay jagadish hare he took the form of a, a dwarf and then there was a challenge and the dwarf as for three steps of land but when he took the three steps the first and second steps he took all of earth and then he asked where should i put this other step and the the asura said put it on my head so this deception and the power of um, vishnu bhagwan came out again there again keshavadrit brigapati roop जय जगदीश हरे जय जगदीश हरे एंड देन ही टुक द फॉर्म ऑफ परशुराम द क्षत्रिय व्हीलिंग द वेपन एंड यू कुड सी हाउ द ग्रेडेशन इज कमिंग अप फर्स्ट इट वाज द फिश नाउ द टर्टल लाइक वी हियर नाउ इन दिस पॉन्ड देयर इज द फिश एंड द टर्टल आर हियर बट देन द द टर्टल कैन बी इन द वाटर एंड द लैंड एंड देन द बोर्ड big also can it's more four legged now and it could move more more easily and it also dwell in the water and the land so you see how we going and then it takes the form of a, a human and, and a, an, an animal and it's moving up now it, it took the form of a of a dwarf so it's it's going evolution high evol- evolving higher and higher and then parasuram that uh, 
angry Chatriya. And then Keshava Dreta Rama Sherira Jai Jagadi Shahare Jai Jagadi Shahare Vishnu Bhagwan taking the form of Bhagwan Sri Ram and he came born in the home of King Dasrat and then he got married to Mother Sita. So you see the evolution is moving. Keshava Dreta Haladhara Rupa Jai Jagadi Shahare Jai Jagadi Shahare Krishna Bhagwan and sometimes Krishna Bhagwan will replace that Vishnu Bhagwan because he's he give us the Bhagavad Gita and what we learn from the Bhagavad Gita we always think that Krishna Bhagwan is by himself but lo and behold he is also a manifestation of Vishnu Bhagwan and um, um, Keshava Dreta Buddha Sharira Jai Jagadish Hare Jai Jagadish Hare So we move from, from Krishna Krishna Bhagwan had no wives He was a brahmachari of course all along But then the Buddha came And he born in this palace But then he found out Oh my God I can't live this life That he was destined The astrologers at the birth Said this person This born in this Hindu home In Lumbini in Nepal He says no After some time he walked out Without his father's permission From the palace Because the father was sheltering him And when he went to the streets He saw the, the sick man Throwing up And he asked his, uh, his caretaker What's happening there? This man is getting sick Oh I'm sick and the, and the Buddha Siddhartha didn't know about this very much and then he said okay um, he kept it in his mind sick then he go a little forward and he says why is that man looking walking so bent back and, and all of this and then the caretaker said oh he's old I'm going to get old like that and look like that yes uh, Siddh Siddhartha ji and then they went further and four men were carrying a dead body and they said why is that man lying where are they carrying him and the, 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 then the, um, the caretaker said he's dead I'm going to be dead too yes all of us has to die and then he walked a little further and he, he drove a little further in his chariot and he saw the um, sadhu with his bald head and his okri robe and he has a pot in his hand and a stick with his clothes at one end and he says, why is that man so happy? And he said, he's an ascetic. He has renounced this world. He has gone beyond this world. And then he said in his mind, I want to be like that. And lo and behold, on his birthday, when they were enjoying themselves and drinking and eating, women lying around half naked, he came out of that. And he went into his the room and he saw his wife and his son Rahul sleeping, the baby next to the mom. And he took some clothes and then he moved out and he asked the attendant, saddle up two horses and then he left. And we know the story that he went through his asceticism and then he came under the Bud tree in Budgaya and seven days and seven nights he became the Buddha, the enlightened one. Aren't we supposed to be like thinking like that also? How old as you are? that you cannot live this life that you're living look at the covid is driving you to do this this is god's doing should we not pay attention to all of this or should we ignore it and go back and looking for old ways to enjoy bodily enjoyment ah no this is not wisdom so this is a message and then the last one uh, one one that i like keshavadrita kalki sharira Jai Jagadish Hare Jai Jagadish Hare Kalki has not come yet But for us at Bharat Seva Ashram Shang, We consider Swami Pranavananda Ji As a manifestation of that Vishnu Bhagwan um, Bhigalita Jeeva Dukkha Karanamrita Ganadeham Sugatita Hindu Samaj Shariram Keshavadrita Pranava Sharira Jai Jagadish Hare Jai Jagadish Hare Om Ah, Pranavananda Swamiji came 
and he united all in, in, irrespective of class, creed or religion. A non-political organization, he started the Bharat Seva Ashram Shain. And then what happened? He united everyone. And he's the prophet of the age because he came and he demonstrated. He came as God and throughout his life he, he maintained that. But he acted as, as a human being, an ordinary child in the beginning. And as he moved on and on, he gathered his school friends and they became they became his first disciples in the monk of Bharat Seva Ashram Sheng. And then he formed the Bharat Seva Ashram Sheng. And from that organization, he moved from then, move, it was then India, but now Bangladesh, he moved from Bajipur to Kolkata. And he started the institution and spread so fast and activities all over the world. I'm a product of Swami Pranavanandaji. Devotees, when I pray to God, because he took me out of this mundane life through a miracle, just sleeping one night and waking up. And he has sustained me all through the time. He took me all over the world and doing all kinds of activities of the ashram, taking the word of the, um, and this message of moksha liberation, like Vishnu Bhagwan has done in his incarnation. How about Krishna Bhagwan? What a dynamic personality. How about the Buddha? Oh, what a great thing. And also we have to honor and respect the Christ and all the credible religions and Gurujis of, of the Indic faiths. This morning, let us contemplate on what we should be doing. Let us not pay attention and importance to this mundane life. It is going to give us sorrow as we see that it's doing. It's constantly changing. Let us shift our attention and importance to our relationship. Let us rediscover that we are that God that we came from, that consciousness. We are manifestation of the five elements that we see here, art, water, fire, air, and space. How beautiful is the sun is reflecting and the water there. Let us look at this. This is our mandir. You don't have to go anywhere. There's no obstacles that will stop us to go to our moksha in this moment. Let us pray. Oh, oh Krishna Bhagavan, Oh Christ, Oh Bhagwan, Buddha, Oh Swami Pranavananji, any guru that you worship, you know, I say these names, but whoever you worship, honor that. Build, make you that deity of yours the object of your worship. Meditate on it. And your prayer should be, Oh Lord, I want to be like you, do, like you. Help me to rediscover that I'm consciousness. Hari Om Shanti Shanti Hari Om. Why don't we spend a few minutes of meditation? Meditation. If you don't have a mantra, let's chant this mantra. Om Sri Guru Shivaya Namah. Om Sri Guru Shivaya Namah. Continue as we observe a moment of, of chanting, silent chanting. Chant the mantra, meditate. Hari Om Shanti Shanti Hari Om. Have a beautiful day. Aren't you feeling good? Why don't you say to yourself, I'm feeling good. When we do positive reinforcements, positive thoughts, positive words and positive actions, then we become positive. Let us always be positive. 
हरिओम शांति शांति हरिओम